the Ashley Corinne, and you know, it was uh, it was it was a hard night last night campaigning. Um, I actually had three individual hangouts on YouTube scheduled all at the same time because I'm a douche, and I decided that I couldn't you know pop into any of them because you know I feel like there's something on my mind you know there's just something that's been you know tickling my brain lately it's I can't put my finger on it <sighs> you know I'm d the fuck the fuck kitty did you do this did you do this Aw, it's okay, kitty. I can't be mad at you while you're licking your crotch. Sorry, it looks as if my kitty was playing a trick on me. Trying to get me to campaign. And I told her, I dropped out of the campaign. For about five minutes, and then I realized that I'm bipolar and I wanted to be in the campaign. And I was going to talk about My Little Pony and about how Rainbow Dash is my favorite because she's a lesbian. But I guess I'll talk about the campaign. I'm running for president. You could have used a softer tape, kitty. Sorry. Sorry. At least she didn't use masking tape. But, seriously, I'm just going to talk about a couple of issues. I'm going to talk about climate, no, fuck. I'm going to talk about abortion. Ah, the court's fucked anyways. Oh, fuck. What am I going to talk about? I think I will talk about free cheese for every mouse. I said it. I know. It's the most controversial political topic since Roe v. But I think that we should give free cheese to every mouse. That way, they don't come into our house and eat our cheese. You know, just scatter the bits. Like, this is London or something. I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about anymore. All I know... All I know is that America is on the highway to the danger zone. You know, I feel like I need to let my foot loose. And um, sometimes I feel like I'm better off dead. But on other days, it feels like this is Ferris Bueller's day off. The Matrix. Now, it might seem like I'm just pulling movie references out of my ass, but I need to go back to the future. Part 3. So what I'm going to do right now is... Line. 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 God, Chuck's passed out in the corner again. He's been getting into those amphetamines. You know, it'll keep you up for a few days, but when you crash, you crash. <sighs> That's why I told him. That's why I tell all the kids, don't do drugs. Except for weed.
But I also want to tell the kids that if you're making a YouTube video and if you're going to use sunglasses, you got to use the reflective lenses because it looks fucking bad. And what I will also tell kids is don't judge Michael Jackson because of all of his court shit. He made a lot of good music back in the 80s. <clears throat> and I will also say this. That when, not if, when I become president in 2020, I will fulfill every weird video game that I ever played that talked about 20XDX because it will be the penultimate of anything that has ever been. Okay, I gotta fucking chill out. <clears throat> I would tell you to give money to my pack, but I don't have no motherfucking pack. I'm doing this Bernie style, but you know how we do it on the streets, man. And I ain't even got no motherfucking pamphlets. You could take my pamphlet if you fucking chaps is assless. You could have this. And that was a freestyle that came out really gay. Anyways, I feel like. I should say, this is Corinne Wednesday running for president in 2020, and my vice president will be either Stephen Colbert, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, uh, Don Rickles, or Mel Brooks. Hell, I'll take all four. This is the Ashley Corinne, also known as Corinne Wednesday, signing out. And if you don't vote for me, you can 